Here at Wanda, there has been a great deal of controversy regarding the dress code. Some students believe the dress code is demeaning towards a specific gender, while others believe the dress code is beneficial to the students. Administration and students give us more insight and their opinions on the dress code. Since the beginning of the school year, there have been two local occurrences regarding firearms in school. A Stahl student and two North Charleston students both brought guns to school. With the sudden increase in students bringing weapons to school, we decided to learn more about Wando security. What's preventing a student from bringing a gun to school? Many changes have been made regarding who is allowed to join Boy Scout troops. Recently, the Boy Scouts of America decided to allow girls to join. While some support the idea of allowing both girls and boys to join, others do not. We took a look into the subject and how it will affect Boy Scout troops. Here at Wando, students pursue their talents in visual and musical arts. However, there has been much debate regarding whether or not these programs have been adequately funded. Wando teachers give us their opinions on the subject. In Mount Pleasant, many people of unique cultural backgrounds have started small businesses that provide different services. Small business owners describe what they went through to build a new life for themselves. Many people dream of starting a successful YouTube channel. For academic magnet student Seth, also known as Pack-a-Puncher, this dream has become a reality. Seth, his family, and his friends describe what he's been through to start his career. With many tragic events occurring across the nation, kindness is appreciated more now than ever. A guidance counselor here at Wando has decided to create a week of kindness to show that being nice to anyone can greatly impact another person's life. This has been Davina Patel reporting for Tribe Talk.